Hello and welcome to the Mike Les Farmhand Mike YouTube channel, bringing you some of the biggest and best variety and definitely the most versatile farming content on social media today. You can find me on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook at Farmhand Mike. When you're running combine and have that view over there, that's just pretty awesome. That's almost as awesome as watching that Mike Les guy on YouTube. That is one good looking tractor and grain cart. Hey everyone, I am very excited to bring you the first corn planting video for the 2022 season here to my YouTube channel. In this video, I am out near Britt, Iowa with Scott and Ryan Johnson as they are working ground and planting their 2022 corn crop. First up, they are working ground with one of their two versatile 550 Delta Track tractors and they are pulling a 60 foot wide Case International field cultivator here. Also in the video is their versatile 405 four-wheel drive tractor pulling their John Deere 24-row 1770 NT planter. This planter is planting 24 rows on a 30-inch row spacing covering 60 foot per pass. These guys also run Johnson drainage putting in field drain tile in the area and this is their other versatile 550 that is on the tile plow. Now this tractor was not running today because they were busy farming. All their versatile tractors come from DNL equipment out of Kensett, Iowa. Now it was fairly windy today, but it's never too windy to get the drone up in the sky and get some great footage for the YouTube channel. Now I have flown drones when it's been pretty windy outside. Trying to get audio is the tough part when it's windy. I do have an external microphone on some of my cameras with the dead cat on it, but when it's windy out in the field here, it is just hard to get that good audio. But we're going to do the best we can. I got a lot of good drone shots here. I got a few on the ground shots, so I hope everyone enjoys this video. Just here the last couple days, the weather has straightened out, so I do have some good stuff for the 2022 planting season coming to my YouTube channel. It's really been a pretty tough spring all across the country. It's been cool. It's been wet. There's a lot of areas that haven't even got to start on anything yet. And some of those areas looks like it might be several more weeks till they get going. They got extreme drought down in Texas and some of the southern states. So we're just going to hope for the best here. Things usually have a way of working out. So hope everybody can get their crop in and we have a good growing season. The first versatile Delta Track was introduced in 2013. Now the ones like you see here with the white roof on it were built for 2013 through 2016. In 2017 these tractors went to the new color scheme with the yellow roof, yellow grill, and so forth. Now they did build the 550 up until through 2017, then it switched in 2018. When this tractor was built here, it came in three different sizes, a 450, a 500, and a 550. So this was the biggest model at the time. In 2018, then they went to the model 520, 570, and the 610. Now for 2022, it's model 530, 580, and 620. Of course, you could get these size tractors also in a wheeled version. These tractors were powered with the Cummins X15. That's a 15-liter, six-cylinder, turbocharged diesel engine. These had the Caterpillar full power shift transmission, hydraulic flow up to 106 gallons per minute, and you could get these with four or six hydraulic remotes. The track systems for these were built by Camso, formerly Camaplast. Not a lot has changed on the track part of the tractor in the frame and so forth even up till model year 2022.
The Versatile 405 four-wheel drive tractor is the smallest articulated four-wheel drive in the Versatile lineup. This frame size comes in three different models, the 405, the 430, and the 460. These three models of tractors are powered with a Cummins 12-liter six-cylinder diesel engine. These have a CAT TA19 full power shift transmission, 16 forward and four reverse speeds. You can get these tractors in either standard flow or high flow hydraulics, putting up to 106 gallons per minute out of either four or six hydraulic remote valves. The Versatile 405 you see in the video here has both a PTO and a three-point hitch on the back. Those are both options that can be factory or field installed. This tractor is also set up with the row crop duals on it, so this tractor is set up to straddle and run 30-inch row spacings.
And let's have a close up look at the back of the tractor and how the planter and everything's set up. That's going to do it for this video. I hope everyone enjoyed it. As I said earlier, I did finally get some footage here of this spring, so I should have a lot of good, exciting tillage and corn planting videos coming to my YouTube channel here for the 2022 season. Anyways, feel free to hit that like button and comment below. And if you are new to my YouTube channel, please go down there and hit that subscribe button. And if you want to see more of what I'm doing, you can also find me on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok at Farmhand Mike. And as always, thanks for watching and supporting my social media.